Hi, and welcome back, beautiful Geminis. Thank you so much for joining me here. Gemini, thank you for your generosity. Guys, thank you for hitting the like button. It really helps the channel out. For that, I, you know, it takes a second, Gemini. So please give the videos a like. If you feel inclined, subscribe. If you feel like commenting, please do so. I love to read your messages. Gemini. Bountiful nature. Spending time in nature helps you shift you to a higher vibration and reminds you of God's infinite abundance. Go outside, enjoy a walk, a hike, or go with your pet. Meditate beneath a tree, a garden, sit under the stars, or do some other activity to connect with the vastness. Savings. As you consistently save for your future, your future is saved. You do your future self a big favor as you consistently set aside present funds. This is part of your self-care and a path to feeling secure. As you focus on your life purpose. Two more. Exercise to increase your energy and your manifestation abilities. The key to manifesting quickly is to have very high energy levels. And the easiest way to increase them is through physical exercise. Choose something fun and meaningful activity that will you that makes you look forward to, even if that's going for a walk in nature, a hike. Have the courage to ask for and accept help. Asking for help is a sign of strength, as is accepting it as it's offered to you. Very often when God, uh, when you ask God for help, prayers are usually answered through other people. Be sure to accept this assistance as well as give it to others as you are guided. Allow helpful, supportive partnerships into your personal life and career, and both parties will benefit as a result. You are receiving help from heaven and from a person who brings needed skills and resources. Okay, let's continue on this. Gemini, clarify this for Gemini. There might be a message of concern here. And it's almost like someone is concerned about a job. Someone is toiling and laboring here. This is a house. Some big change is coming up. Make sure you set aside money. This person could be in despair okay someone could have lost a job or is in despair concerned about losing a job huh huh well they're dealing with a false person Oh, Jesus, who's putting them into poverty? Look, the false person has a child at a distant horizon. They're going broke. Someone's a thief. Okay. Not cool. This person may ask for your help. Hmm. Oh, well, it's a mirror here. Thought that this was going to be bliss. It's been a major loss. This person's praying for something praying to the universe. Okay, well, they got scarred. They chose someone very unhealthy. Divine order. 
trying to put them on the right path. Hmm. Well. they would need your help. Now they need your help. You may have become this privileged lady while they've been gone. It's looking like whoever they chose, they chose a deceptive false person. They're a thief. They might be losing their job. Getting a lot of bad karma here. Let's see if they are getting bad karma here. Spirit, why do the... Mm, they're trying to dodge bullets. They're foolish. Mm. I said bad karma. Hello. They could have even ghosted you. Now they're looking you up. They've been wasting their time dealing with a clout hungry person. Maybe because they were lonely. I don't know. Felt ignored. You're highly respected on it. Now they're getting nightmares. People talking shit. Same shit, different day. They got involved with a clout, hungry, obsessive lover. A dangerous, toxic, unhealthy, possessive karmic. Now they're going to have to come kiss your ass. They could be losing a car, getting their vehicles represented, talking shit. But they're so busy talking shit about you. They were hustled. And now they got to move. You're not even phased by this. Them and their groupies. They could have married for money, see? Up in their head. The one they got with the drama starter. Always partying. Just waiting to dust this person off. This karmic ain't shit. They're just like, so what? Prove it. That's what they're doing. So what? Prove it. They're being haunted now. So they chased them. This person feels foolish. They have a low IQ. They fell for something and they got scammed. Now they got to try and get themselves out of it. Oh boy, marrying for money, family issues. You're sitting there not even bothered. This person was traveling, made someone else an offer, and now they're curious about you, see? Oh, Jesus. So this one was digging up dirt on you, had told you they're a thief. I'm trying to... Get the inside scoop of you nosy all up in your business. What the hell? Fake accounts. Give me a break. Creeping. Oh, I'm somebody. Karmic, karmic friends. Oh, jeez. Oh, You've hit the jackpot over here, moving in silence. And now there's sad hurt crying over you. Went for ego. Huh. Wow. I'll give you spirits saying, I'll give you something to whine about. I'm getting a lot of bad karma, legal issues. They're 
giving this money? Oh, so they were impersonating you. Now this person wants wants their main person back. They're sad, hurt, crying over you. Thought they were going to be, oh, look, power hungry was a trap. They're a thief. Going broke. They're lying. Samper is under judgment, and so are the karmics. Oh, God. Oh, they're depressed. They could be going to court, legal issues. They're wishing they weren't so dumb. Hmm. Lying. Court. Ooh, they're hurting. They're stressed out and worrying. Sad, hurt, crying over you. They were juggling. Oh my Lord of mercy. Hmm. Now it's like they need your help. Thinking you're going to reject them. They're hitting a crisis here. Yep. Financial crisis. Could be losing a home, a mortgage, or something. Somebody may have made fake accounts. Oh, they got problems. You're highly respected and honored. What the hell is this? They were giving money to a manipulator. They're angry. Ooh, boy, this person is angry. They thought that this was love. <sighs> Married and betrayed. Yep, going broke here. Child issues, family issues, they're hurt. It's bad karma. Lies, deception. Thought it was funny, talking behind your back, making fun of you. So now they got to go through it. Now they want to come back and apologize. Now you are the have and they are the have not. They did it to themselves. They are getting bad karma for a reason. And that's because they were sneaky ass. I'm not making excuses for them. Yes, the karmic is clout hungry, but they were a fraud. They're a fraud. They're a fake. And now that they're broke, Whose help do they need? The Empress's help. The 
is all funny. Having all these people laughing behind the Empress's back, thinking it was so damn ass funny. Making fun of the Empress. There are whole works of them are getting bad karma. So it's looking now that they're broke. The karmic's done with them. Hustled them out of their coin. And now they want to return to the Empress. They could have even prayed for help. You know what I mean? They could have prayed for help. If they didn't realize it was right, right under their nose the whole time. Someone was impersonating you. Someone was impersonating you. Fake accounts, stuff like that. Who knows what these karmic and karmic friends are up to. It's just hideous how, how low some of them will stoop. They could have actually put fake accounts in your name. Like making up stories about you that you, I mean, this person has low IQ. So it's like they could have thought that you were doing this when it was whoever they married or went to. They married a thief. A liar. Take care.